Hello everyone, this is Braden Chase for Easy Funnel System. Thank you for being here with me. And um, I have been working a lot over the past little while and it's been great. I've done a lot of fun things. And um, I've been watching a couple of videos and, and teaching some of my lessons that I do online, course creation and things. And, and this, a, a lesson keep cropping up and I wanted to share it with you guys a little bit. So um, the best way that I know how to teach this is actually with a story from a while ago. So um, I remember back in 2015, 2016, when Donald Trump was kind of starting to become, you know, a, a person of note in, in the political realm, he started his campaign and doing these kinds of things. There was a study that came out that analyzed the, the vocabulary and the level of language that each of the Republican candidates was doing. And um, Ben Carson was like a ninth grade level and Ted Cruz, I think was an eighth grade level. And um, Donald Trump was like a third or a fourth grade level, something like that, like way, way, way low. And the person who showed this to me was like, look, he's stupid because he's, he only has a third grade level, right? And I kind of laughed because, I mean, I'm an English teacher, right? And I'm, I'm looking at this and I'm like, okay, that's not stupidity, that's strategy. And, and as, as a language teacher, right, I process this and I know how this works because we as human beings, right, we process language at a much lower level than what we're actually capable of understanding. So when things are, especially new things, are explained to us at a lower level, we understand it easier and faster and with less effort. And we like it better when it's easier. When things are complex with unfamiliar vocabulary or long words, it's unfamiliar to us. We kind of back off from it a little bit. and We don't understand as clearly. It's more difficult to have people understand us when we're communicating. And um, that, that, that lesson was something that I had to kind of help my friend understand. I'm like, oh, well, he might not be that smart. I don't know. I don't really know Donald Trump, but this is a strategy. As a businessman, I know he's doing that on purpose. Instead of saying, you know, this is a disaster, he says, this is really, really bad because that's a simpler language. It's easier to understand. Now, the, the reason, why am I saying this? The, within business, right, as we're doing, especially as we're doing marketing of our online courses, we tend to be um, specialists in whatever our field is, if it's medicine or language or, or mechanics or marketing or business or productivity or whatever it is, we know our stuff. We know the words, we know the jargon, we know the language, we know the vocabulary, we know the phrases and the right names of people to throw in there. Um, but our students don't. That's why they're coming to us, is because they don't know those things. So when we approach our students with this higher level jargon, it doesn't make sense to them quickly. It's not easy for them to understand. And since we're throwing these big words at them, or maybe not even big words, but just unfamiliar words at them, they can't process it. And since they don't process it, they don't come to your school. They don't come to your course. They don't buy your things. They don't learn from you and they don't progress, right? You're not able to help your students because they can't even understand you, right? In your, in your emails or in your sales message or on your pages or your headlines or whatever it is that you're using, they can't even understand you. So this is kind of a, a purposeful um, lesson as I've been going through some of my things and simplifying them a little bit. Some people like to say dumbing down. I don't like that term. Um, it's just the way our brains work. Our brains are able to process at a certain level of language, not even a level, certain type of language more easily than other types of language. And when you see really high quality copywriters or online marketers or marketers of any kind, the way they use language is always really, really strategic and simple and direct. And, and um, if you want your students or your clients or the people that you're trying to attract to you and, and for whatever reason, if you want them to actually come, use the language that they understand. Use um, a, a simpler level language. So that's just kind of my language, or my language, that's my lesson. <laughs> that's my lesson for today. Thank you guys very much. And I will talk to you another time.